So I just got out of work and I said, you know what I want more than anything? I want some really good hot dogs. So we're gonna go out to Yakos and give it a try. I think it could blow our minds. He is the hot dog king after all. Hey there and welcome back to Snackable. Today on Snackable we're gonna be trying Yakos, who is the hot dog king. I, I don't, you know, I don't, I don't know what you heard, but he is the king of all kings. Uh, oh, hold on. <laughs> wait, wait a second. I'm the king of kings. He is the lord of lords. I'm in a goofy mood today. I don't know why, but um, we're, we're here at Yakos. It's out in Allentown. Uh, it's right off of 78. And uh, we, we came out here because I keep hearing about it. And I said, you know what? I want to go to Yakos. You know, I said, we're going to do it as an extra snackable for this week. So I hope you enjoy. Uh, and, uh, you know, because I'm working on a bunch of stuff for the next couple of weeks and it's it's stressful. So I said, we're going to go to Yakos. It's going to be a great snackable. It's going to be awesome. And it probably will be an awesome video. We're going to go through the drive through right now because it appears this one, the inside is not open. Uh, just imagine like a rinky dink sort of place side of the road that has like the benches that are connected with one freaking table. And that's the inside of Yakos. Just imagine that. Here's here's a stock image. It looks exactly like that because I, I can see it through the window. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go order our food. One second. All right. So we got our Yakos right here. Uh, I got the crinkle cut fries and I got a uh, a a hot dog, which is at the bottom. Gosh, feels like I'm getting the jaws of life out of here. Did they not give me a bun? No, they gave me a bun. Oh, it's Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. So, not a great. <laughs> Look at they like smashed it. It's like the size of a finger. Look at that. <laughs> All right. Listen. <laughs> they like. I, I So, I didn't get it with everything because I didn't want everything. And I said, just the chili sauce. And I was like, you just want the chili sauce? So, I feel like. <laughs> This is like a hate crime. Who did this? <laughs> I am a victim of a hate crime. Stanley knows what I'm talking about. That's not what a hate crime is. Well, I hated it. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, listen, it's it's not about the look. It's about the taste. So we're going <laughs> to... We're going to see how this tastes. <laughs> I'm not even mad. I'm just like, why? <laughs> what happened? Like, what... What occurred that you said, you know what, <laughs> screw you, buddy. <laughs> this is, this is ridiculous. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> uh, all right. All right. Let's give it a, let's give it a taste. Hmm. It sort of tastes like every ballpark rank ever. Um, listen, I'll say that this isn't a hate crime. But the the small amount of chili that is on this that is a hate crime. Also, calling it sauce, I think, is a hate crime. But maybe maybe I'm calling too many things hate crimes at this point. Well, I hated it. I mean, yeah, it's it's fine. I mean, I feel like I could have gotten a better hot dog at Sheets. I, I have. I get them all the time, and they're delicious. Uh, wow. Uh, yeah, I mean, if I ate three out of ten, you know, I'm sorry. That was, uh, that was not a good hot dog. Um, mm, yeah. You could taste the burnt on it, which you often get with, like, ballpark hot dogs. Not the brand ballpark, but, like, when you're at a ballpark and you're like, yeah, hey, hot dogs, yeah. That's, that's what it tasted like. And not in a good way. And it was extra burnt. And it, listen, if I say chili sauce, I want it spilling out the slice, come out the top, you know. I want it dripping down my shirt. I want to look like a freaking monster. If I could transport anywhere in the world and I could only pick three places of where I could get the best chili dog, it would probably be Casey's Corner. Then I would probably go to Sheets because I think their chili dog slaps. If you haven't tried it, give it a try. That's probably a nine out of 10. It's really, it's truly wonderful. And then Skyline Chili. When I used to drive all around the uh, country, I would try Skyline Chili and it was good. It was decent. And the, the cheese wasn't melted on top, which that's a pet peeve of mine. If you don't know, listen, if I only had three choices, if I only had one choice, this would never be it. If I had four choices, I'd have to find another place to get a chili dog because I wouldn't come here. Scathing review. I know, but this is not snackable. Do not waste your time.
But we're going to check out the fries and see if the fries are good. You know, I'm doing the Donald Trump hands again. Listen, listen, the fries, they might be redeemable. What, what do I know? I know it all. I mean, you know, they're the basic fries you get. I mean, these are good fries. They're fine. They're hot, a little crispy, salty, you know. These fries for me, probably 7 out of 10. Yeah, they're fine. They're, they're, they're nothing to write home about. Nothing to call your mom and say, I found the one, you know. It's just, I wonder what that's like. <laughs> I am goofy today. I am very goofy. Okay, so they have basic fries. Just basic fries. They have garbage hot dogs, which I didn't get everything on. If extra toppings, listen, I'm this is I'm heated now because I'm imagining somebody commenting, "You didn't eat the the Yako hot dog, right? You needed to have everything." If you have to put fifteen thousand toppings on this freaking hot dog to make it good, it's not good. <laughs> it's just not. I can't handle it. That's just you know. And listen, this person didn't even. If you're a friend of mine, please write this comment down so that this doesn't look like a madman. The hot dog was trash. The The fries were mid. Uh, let's see if they mess up the drink. If they mess up the drink, guess what? I'm done. I'm never coming back here again. I'm never coming to this city again. How did they mess up a Coke? It's a Coke. They give you the syrup already. It's... Ah! <laughs> What is happening? Why is this garbage? I don't get it. It was so simple. All you had to do was make the food. I give this whole experience a 2 out of 10. Easy 2 out of 10. I just, I don't get it. What happened? Jakob, you're supposed to be the king. The king of kings, the lord of lords, the savior of mankind. And you ruined us. You are literally Lucifer! That one was probably too much. But uh, I'm really disappointed in you, buddy. Um, you were you were supposed to be the hot dog king. And uh, you ever watch Game of Thrones? You're Joffrey. You are 100% Joffrey. You're not even the real king. You're not the chosen king. You know, you, you can't even be well known enough to be the mad king. You're just this guy wearing a crown. I'm sorry. I hope, I hope your social media team reaches out to me. Not that I'm that big, not that anybody knows who I am, but they reach out and they go, this is Dingo Dan, how dare you? We're gonna destroy you. The hot dog king knows, and he's gonna, he's gonna rain down his rain. Listen, uh, you can do whatever you wanna do. Try this for yourself if you like. I'm just gonna tell you, Nate Keck, I'm sorry, you were right. I shouldn't have tried this. Uh, he told me it was garbage, and I should have listened. This is, this is grade A trash. I, it it didn't make me want to vomit. It wasn't disgusting. It was just like, this is not the way it's supposed to be. So, I'm sorry, but that's that's my review. But please like and subscribe. Comment down below what I should try next. Listen, things, things happen. You need to get out there and try new things. And sometimes they're really bad scenarios. You know, sometimes somebody just took a hot dog and smashed it. You know, this is, it's all the girls that I've ever asked out. They're just like... But again, thank you guys so much for watching. And I guess we'll have to see what we're trying next time. Bye.